can you feel that? The energy is starting to rise again as Dogecoin and the community around it finally are starting to feel those good vibes that we like to feel. Big articles coming out. This one, Dogecoin investors are trying to push the value to $1 as well as multiple others. Big, big, big publications coming in. Dogecoin surges from seeing in business. Coinbase says some users can trade it after that announcement. And we have seen that across the entire media landscape. This one as well saying Dogecoin price jumps on Coinbase debut prospect. Part of this and the spike around it is because of being added on Coinbase Pro. And part of it is because of the energy and excitement around the future edition that's going to be on Coinbase not too long from now. An extremely bullish price prediction that I'm about to show you right now based on what I've been seeing is $1 coming soon. I'll show you exactly what I think about that. As we're also seeing right now, the current landscape of cryptocurrency, make sure, by the way, after you come in, you tap that like button one time, just go down there and press it, smash it, do what you need to do to it, just handle your business, make sure you and the like button have a good relationship moving forward, because if you don't press the like button enough, it's going to get mad at you, and it, that's not a good thing, we don't want that, we want the like button to be in unity with the community, look at that, a rhyme there, as we see Bitcoin, Ethereum, Binance Coin, Tether, Cardano, Dogecoin, and XRP currently at the top seven, once more more Polkadot, USD coin, Uniswap, Chainlink, Internet Computer, Bitcoin Cash, Litecoin, Polygon, Stellar, Solana. Those are the ones behind it. Really though, at the top, that's where we're most focused right now. Dogecoin, by the way, going up more than any other top cryptocurrency. The, we have to go all the way down to, I believe, uh, pretty dang far. We have to go all the way down to... Huh, dang it, I can't even find one. Dogecoin may be, out of all the top 100s, the biggest gainer so far today, which is pretty incredible. Up 14 or 15%, I mean, 28% on the week. So the biggest gainer of the week and the biggest gainer of the entire day as well. When you combine those two things together, you start to realize Dogecoin is not like the rest. It stands out from the pack and it has the potential to do some pretty crazy spikes on its own, even without some of the other top cryptos. Binance Coin, by the way, is also doing pretty well. Cardano, surprisingly, has not gone up much at all, despite Bitcoin going up 3%. That's a little bit weird because you would think that wouldn't be the case, and yet somehow it is. I guess that's just the way it's going to be for now, but... Here's the charts of Dogecoin right now. Currently, we're at a price of around 43 cents. Look at that. Pretty dang bullish. And I'll talk a little bit more about my analytical price prediction just simply based on the chart regardless of any news that comes out because if we don't see news coming out we're going to want to see what's going to happen with the chart despite that even though the news can change it drastically either positively or negatively potentially positively i think is the way more likely thing there i'll explain what i mean by that but here this is kind of crazy here's a running list of all of the companies let me read a couple of these chats first <laughs> come on doge i love it but here, here's a running list of all of the companies that are currently ahead of Dogecoin, or I'm sorry, the other way around. Here are all the companies that are currently behind Dogecoin in terms of market cap. Dogecoin right now at a market cap of around 55 billion puts it close to Cardano, almost about to pass Cardano, getting very, very, very close, only around less than a billion away from passing Cardano and not that far away from passing Binance Coin again. It's already been at that three spot before. We want to go back up to that three spot again, not including Tether, of course, got to throw it in there, but here is the running list. Now, this is remarkable. When you start to look down this list, it's surprising in some ways, but it also makes sense in other ways because Dogecoin is bigger than, than a simple company can ever be in a lot of ways. American, so here, here, here's the entire list of all the companies smaller right now than Dogecoin. And there's more, but these are the ones at the top in the S&P 500, I believe. Dollar General, Marriott International, American International Group, Walgreens Boots Alliance, Twitter, which is kind of ironic because a lot of the energy around Dogecoin has come from Elon Musk on Twitter. <laughs> and also, Matt Walsh has a Twitter too, if, if you don't know. It's Matt Walsh 88, and we, we have some fun. There's some good information too. It's not just fun. We actually, actually post updates in real time, so Twitter can be valuable if you want to go follow with the notifications on there. I also will occasionally post random things for like a minute to reward people who have the notifications on just as a way of saying thank you for that. But dude, you need to check out Chico Crypto latest video talking about Dogecoin. You will love it to the moon. You know what? I'm gonna take a picture of that right there and I will try to remember after the show to go and watch that. I love supporting other creators in the community and uh, there's, there's, I mean, there's so many amazing, amazing people who are not only posting on uh, Instagram and Twitter and, and YouTube as well, but not just not not just with me. Anytime you see a video from any creator, we need to be pressing like on that. It helps Dogecoin moving forward. We want to be really proving that Dogecoin has a higher engagement rate than any other community, and that's going to be the most valuable tool for us moving forward. That is one of the reasons why Dogecoin can have a spike like it's had, even though all the other cryptos are kind of down a little bit or not even spiking that much. 
Thanks, Matt, to the moon coming in from Sean. Thank you so much. And thank you, Anthony, as well, for the chats coming in to the moon. Sam coming in as well. Thank you, Sam, for the chats. And Crypto Tank Girl on Hampton Beach, New Hampshire, harassing bars to accept the OG. <laughs> See Twitter video. Oh, no. Are you harassing bars? Well, at least, at least you're doing it for a good cause. I mean, at least you're doing it for a good cause. Twitter, Kimberly Clark, T. Rowe Price, eBay, Allstate, Ferrari, Aflac, General Mills, Corning, Southwest Airlines, Hilton Worldwide, Dr. Horton, Delta Airlines, Best Buy, Kroger, Viacom, Slack, Kellogg, Hewitt Packer, Caesars, United Airlines, AMC Entertainment, and GameStop, GameStop stock. And those two are, I think, the funniest. It's bigger than GameStop, GameStop stock and AMC combined, which is kind of crazy because we love seeing AMC and, and GME go up. That's one of the most fun things to watch in all of the stock world outside of cryptocurrency. So it's kind of silly to see that. But at the same time, what we've seen in the last 24 hours with those three, Dogecoin, GameStop, and AMC, is that all of them have gone up. So that's basically proving that this community, it doesn't have to be one or the other. And there's a lot of people who are sharing in all of the communities there because we like going against those in power. It's kind of a similar mindset. It's not all the same people, but it's a lot of the same people. And that's why that's why there's there's a, there's a special amount of energy that's additional right now because people are starting to realize that this community is more spread out and has more people in it than everyone was thinking before. And um, Matt, what do you think? And, and let me know how that goes, Crypto Tank Girl. If you can get some bars to accept the OG, it may be difficult. But if you can, if you can succeed, then you're going to help the community. Uh, Matt, what? Don't don't be too mean though. Don't don't be mean to them. And not that you would. Matt, what do you think about Doge in price will be? Yeah, so let's go ahead and talk about that right now. My prediction for Doge. And you saw me. I put one dollar in the thumbnail, and that is because I believe that one dollar is going to come not that long from now. It's impossible to put an exact price prediction for when it's going to happen, it's just simply because we don't know when the big stories are going to come out. But here's kind of my thinking behind that. I believe Elon Musk is right now waiting for the Coinbase listing first before he announces some of the big things that he's planning with Dogecoin, before he starts maybe putting it on his rocket in terms of paying a big Dogecoin on or doing other things like that. He's continuing to do the memes. He's already announced he's getting his Dogecoin Shiba Inu dog soon. So I think all it's taking, the reason he hasn't done the more stuff yet is because he realizes that if it's on Coinbase first when he does that, those spikes are going to be significantly bigger and significantly better. He's playing this smart. There's no rush. We're holding for the long haul. We don't need it to happen extremely fast. We are willing to wait until there's a better opportunity in the future for some of these things. That's Elon's mindset, and I think it's the perfect mindset. So $1 Doge and potentially going way, way, way above that is something that is in the future cards for Doge as long as the things we're expecting to happen do happen, which is why we're so optimistic about it. And remember, this is the channel that's been talking about, I've been talking about since it was less than half a penny. Look at that. It may be starting to spike again right now. Back up to 437. Looks like it may be starting to spike at this current point in time during the live. If this turns into a spike live, that's going to really get me excited. I'm going to have a lot of fun with that. But we have been talking about Doge. I haven't shown this in a while because we've been so focused on a lot of the big stories. But let's go ahead and take a look. So this is the final stand videos from the very beginning. We've been posting every single day. This is the only channel for close to half a year now. And uh, that's basically ever since Dogecoin was at half a penny, posting every single day, big updates along the way. I was live for pretty much all the big landmarks. There was a time when there was no other Dogecoin influencer out there that was posting every single day or even posting hardly at all about it. There were occasional videos from time to time, but there was nothing like this. And so we have from, from that really turned this into one of the most amazing communities on the internet. And Elon Musk obviously deserves the vast majority of the credit for that. But I think our community definitely deserves a huge amount of credit for that as well, because of all of us who have been pressing like and helping with this there's the first video right there that's been getting a lot of views recently because people wanted to go back and say hey what was the first video like but this is why you should be subscribing with notifications on come join the original and i believe the best dogecoin community on the internet come have fun with us and be pressing like on videos and, and, and doing all the stuff if you are pressing like right now on this video that will help it get to more people so let's make sure we're doing that for a little bit i was forgetting to remind people to press like and our views went down just a tiny bit not that much honestly it, it, I, I thought it would go down more it, it really didn't go down that much it's more of just the time when it's most important to press like is when there's energy around Doge. Because when there's not that much energy, people still aren't going to find it that easily anyway because there's not as many people searching. But when there's energy like right now and when there's people searching, this is the time when it's most important to press like on the videos. So that's why you, you, sometimes we'll, we'll, we'll talk more about like and sometimes we'll talk less about it. But now it's one of the times when we're talking more about it because it really is valuable at this current point in time. And uh, we're also seeing... 
So Tesla competitor becomes first to mine Dogecoin, Bitcoin, and Ethereum with parked electric cars. We talked about that a little bit on last night's live, but that's interesting though. Tesla's getting beat. Come on, Tesla, get your act together. That could be one of the things though that Elon's waiting until after the Coinbase announcement before he, he talks about that. That could be one of the things. Um, if, you, if you've been following since the beginning, you are doge money coming in from jacob i love the sound of that also this one coming in what about the designers helping doge go worldwide from crypto styles yes that's definitely a huge 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 help as well so thank you and thank you for the chat crypto styles i think i was the first to call you an influencer and you are soaring just like doge spiking keep it up so you were the first to call me an influencer that's pretty cool when it comes so i see what you're saying so you probably were talking on twitter and so you you saw this channel first before any other any other dogecoin thing a lot of people who have been here since the beginning uh, it's kind of crazy to think about how much this community has grown we are now the fastest growing new channel on all of YouTube in 2021 by a significant margin. It's really not even close right now. And that's just insane. That goes to show you, yes, part of it is, is, you know, we're putting a lot of hard work, but also part of it is just the community behind it is continuing to show how strong we are, that we're capable of building something like this that fast. We deserve some credit. All of us do. Um, the world, the world will hear Dogecoin's name to the moon and a hold AMC. Yeah, so I, I did I did sell 50% of my AMC stock to buy Dogecoin with it. And uh, I, I don't know, I, don't, I think that was the right decision because if it does go back down, I'll probably buy some more back in with different money. I'm not going to sell my Dogecoin. The money I put into Dogecoin, I'm continuing to hold for the long haul. But I don't know, it, it, was that the right decision? Maybe it was, maybe it wasn't. The reason why I'm still holding 50% is to continue supporting the community. I also, I'm also going to keep talking about AMC stock. I love it. I'll probably go more in on AMC stock at some point in the future, and we'll talk more about it. But for now, I think Dogecoin is, uh, is, is really what I want to be. Uh, what I want to be the most optimistic about right now, because I think it deserves that. That's right. You're right. To do only good every day, coming in from Jacob. Thank you for the chat, Jacob coming in. And I, I agree, as long as we're doing good things and doing only good every day, doesn't mean you have to be good all the time. I'll simply all it means is just treat people with respect. I mean, it's as simple as that. If you have a disagreement with someone, just go tell them, tell them what it is and talk talk about it, get over it. That's that's the best way to, to deal with things like that. There's always gonna be conflict and stuff. It happens in every single community ever that's ever existed. But what really shows a strong community is when that conflict can be resolved by people who are are being bigger than the situation. Hey Matt, I hope you're enjoying wallet coin. I think Doge on Coinbase is bigger than Tesla accepting Dogecoin. I know people only trust Coinbase. Josh Combs, that's an interesting, uh, an interesting thought right there. Which is bigger? It being added on Coinbase or it being accepted by Tesla? I don't know. I, I would say Tesla probably would be bigger just in my opinion. You could be right. But that would, so the average increase of 91% from being added on Coinbase, then you compare that with Tesla, Bitcoin went up approximately 90% or something like that from being added there. So it's kind of it's kind of like conflicting a little bit. Which one's gonna be bigger? Maybe they'll both be equally big. That's also possible. But my personal prediction is because of the amount of attention it will get from Tesla accepting it, that could actually be bigger, especially if we wait until after the Coinbase listing before that happens, because then all the people on Coinbase will see the Tesla thing and have way more access to buying it. So that's what I wanna see. I wanna see first Coinbase, then Tesla announcement. I'm finishing up, Ethan says, I'm finishing up at work right now, listening in, I added to my positions under 0 0.30, so good I did, to the moon. I did as well, I was buying more. I was showing you guys that I was buying more. I was posting that on Twitter. If you wanna see my, my, my buys, you're welcome to follow there. Uh, but I, I normally I normally post most of my buys on there. Um, Mini coming in with the chat as well, thank you Mini. Yes, exactly, Elon for president, my Twitter. You can keep the campaign informing brother Elon and Kanye for president. I think we're all going to be on board with that. Why not? Why not? For president of Mars, of course. I mean, the, the USA, no, we don't even need a president. We'll, we'll just we'll just go presidentless. Do you have a huge favor? Do you, oh, do yourself a huge favor. Remain a Doge hustler. You know Doge so well. Let Matt and Trey take care. I see what you're saying. Yeah. Well, no, we're, we're still going to talk about AMC stock some because um, I, I think I have some great insight with it. But yeah, I, I do know what you mean. Yeah, we'll, we'll focus mostly on uh, on on Doge, of course, because, but not just Doge, other cryptocurrencies as well. This channel is not just about Dogecoin, even though it's our favorite one and we love it the most. It's about information. It's about information with what's happening in the market. It's about being able to figure out. So we have the advantage over everyone else in the market. And that includes AMC. We wanna be able to take advantage of those and also help with those in the case where it's actually in more of like a, a, a mission type thing where we're trying to accomplish something, either help with it or make money from it. There's a lot of things that we can all get as individuals and also as a community from that. But Dogecoin's market cap. 
Is is now okay? That I already read that one. All right, let's go. Let's go to the next one. Cryptocurrency ban, unworkable and unwise. I love this coming in from WSJ.com. They're one hundred percent right about that. You can't really do it successfully without weight causing way more problems than you actually end up solving or fixing. You would you create more. Um, let me read this chat as well. Just tuning in. Any big news I missed for you? Yes. So unfortunately, unfortunately, the, the big news is that Matt Wallace is officially retiring from from YouTube. It's it's been a good run. Oh wait, no, that's not the big news. Matt Wallace isn't retiring. <laughs> no, I'm I'm just kidding. No, yeah. So we we have seen basically more big articles coming out. The energy around it. That's kind of what's happening. Also, make sure just you can also just slide the little thing back and watch from the beginning if you want. I, I would I'd rec definitely recommend doing that because it was a pretty dang uh, pretty dang good amount of information that we already have talked about. Uh, Mr. J Boxing. Oh, nice. Hashtag Mr. J Boxing. So yeah, you're doing some Dogecoin boxing. I like the sound of that. Uh, we I, I remember I remember your previous chats about that. Coinbase rival Kraken launches mobile app in US to capitalize on crypto surge. That right there is what I'm talking about. Shout out to Kraken. They have definitely a lot of advantages over other exchanges. I'm, I don't currently uh, I don't currently spend that much time talking about them, but maybe we should. Elon Musk reputation hits a low on Twitter after attacking Bitcoin. What? Oh no. Let's go ahead and check. Elon Musk's reputation hit a low. Oh, oh well, that's not good. Well, let me go. Let me go and pull it up real quick. Let me pull it up. Elon Musk Twitter. Okay, let's check. Let's check. Let's check. I'm nervous. I'm super nervous. Oh, oh wait a sec. Wait a sec. It's he's he's getting more likes than ever. Wait, what, what, what are they talking about? They didn't they didn't they just say that Elon Musk Twitter he was less popular than ever? Look at that, three hundred fourteen thousand likes, thirty nine thousand retweets. His followers have been going up too. Where is that? What are you talking about? This article is is just one of the most ridiculous things I've ever seen in my entire life. That is not even close to true. Not only that, but on top of that, Elon Musk is a huge reason why Bitcoin even went as high as it did in the first place. So any hate on him specifically for that is unjustified in my opinion. I don't get it. Some people are just haters, I guess. This article coming in from Zach Guzman. So it is of time. It is time, of course, to roast Zach Guzman. Let me, let me go ahead and pull the roast music. We, we have to get the roast underway. We don't really have a choice at this point because Zach, he, he, came, he came in a very, very, very unprofessional way, in my opinion, after the man who is just trying to make the world a better place. And by the way, we do, if Elon does, does bad stuff, we call him out on it. I mean, we do. But he rarely does bad stuff. And the times we do that, we're also very respectful when we do that. So we, we have to respect Elon. He, he, he's, earned, he's earned the right to do some things that we don't like with all the positive things he has done, in my opinion. But let me go ahead and play the music. Zach, it says he's a senior writer, but perhaps they misspelled senior in high school because this article is very juvenile. No offense to the seniors in high school out there. I would, I do not want to be comparing you to Zach, so I, I, I'm sorry for that. Definitely no, no offense there. Zach Guzman, maybe he's trying to be more like Zach Efron. I don't know. That doesn't even make any sense, but definitely he shouldn't be writing articles like this unless he wants to think about it first and actually look at the stats and analytics. He had no good points in there except for his opinions. This guy is a hater and he's always going to be that's not that real reason he doesn't like Elon there's of course more personal reasons behind this it's obvious and uh, you're not fooling anyone no one is taking this seriously mr. senior writer hashtag dogecoin boxing I love it bro uh, coming in also let me first chat first drew drew says coinbase I'll read your chat next coinbase used to have dogecoin subscription as started as a joke they removed it and changed it to lighthearted alternative to, to tradition traditional cryptocurrency I do like that but or maybe even they should be nicer than that. They should say lighthearted alternative that is significantly better in a lot of ways than, than to the traditional cryptocurrencies at the top right now. But that is still much better. Thank you, Coinbase, for doing that. Now that they're listening, I guess they kind of have to, right? They don't want to be calling it that when they're listing it. Dogecoin Boxing, I love it, bro. Coming in from MRJ Boxing. My good friend is working on throwing boxing matches with me and charging Doge and USD, but giving a significant discount to Dogecoin spenders. I believe it will work. Now, that's the good thinking right there. You don't have to pay with Dogecoin, but if you do, you get a discount. I feel like that would incentivize some people to actually buy Dogecoin and then spend it on that. That's pretty dang smart. So definitely shout out to you, Mr. J Boxing, for that way of thinking. Any news on Sophie Stock? I do not know any any recent updates on that. What what is so Sophie Stock? Is that? Let me, let me go and pull it up. Is that is that doing something cool right now? I'm, I'm interested in it. I'm, I'll, I'll pull it up for fun. Sophie stock 
Sophie Technologies, it, it seems to be going down a little bit right now. We'll, we'll, we'll see what it does, I guess, if, we, if, if you want to be keeping us updated. I'm probably not going to be doing it myself, but if you want to keep us updated in the chats, you're welcome to, to do that, and I will continue reading those. Google Marcus Robert Johnson bar boxing and roast me, please. Hashtag Dogecoin boxing. Oh, should I roast you? Okay, well, you know what? You invited it, so I'm going to have to do that. When has Elon been behind anything and it failed? Exactly. That's You were 100% right about that. Name one thing Elon has tried at and failed at. You can't. I mean, unless you want to say, oh, maybe something. I don't know. Is there something? I can't think of anything off the top of my head. He, he, I mean, I know Elon pretty dang well. I can't think of a single thing. That, that goes to show you when he dedicates his mind to something, he normally accomplishes it and even goes significantly above that. We all know that by now. But um, I, I'll wait. <laughs> Doge baby. Nice. But yeah, let me. I'll, I'll Google that. Marcus Robert Johnson boxing and we will roast you. It's also some free publicity for you because you deserve it. And, um, or not, I guess you did leave a chat, so it's not really free, <laughs> but it, I mean, I, I would give it to you for free if you just put, if I, if I saw your chat, um, and just like a normal chat, but Marcus Robert Johnson boxing, let me go ahead and pull it up. Marcus Robert Johnson boxing. All right, this better this better be this better be good. My roast of it, it has to live up to the hype. Oh, there we go, there we go. Is this is this is you? Oh, which which one are you? Are you the winner or the loser? Okay, you know what? You're probably the winner, but we're gonna pretend like you're the loser just for the purpose of the roast. Sorry, sorry, buddy. Look at that. He's raising the other dude's hand and yours is down. Even though I'm probably off on that and you're actually the winner. What the heck are these two guys wearing? All the same color. It doesn't even look that professional. Where's the Dogecoin things? Dogecoin, super professional, very professional, much professional, most professional. If you had a big Dogecoin on there, I would definitely like this picture more. So what the heck are you doing? Where's the Dogecoin? There's the roast of you, Marcus Johnson Boxing. But for real though, sh shout out to you. I, I, hope, I hope you have much success and you probably are the winner there. But whoever the dude you fired is, looks a lot like you. It's I can't even tell. Like you guys literally look very similar. Uh, but let me let me go ahead and let me go ahead and read a couple more of these chats. Hashtag Dogecoin boxing, love it, bro. I already read that one. What is your thoughts on? Uh, oh, the most pri the best price prediction of Polygon. So Polygon, uh, I'll pull it up real quick. Polygon. I mean, it's a shape. It's it's a shape crypto. It's. You can't you can't go wrong with shape cryptos, can you? Is there can shape cryptos even go down? Is that even possible? I don't know. Maybe shape cryptos just continue going to the moon forever, perhaps. Is that possible? Ha uh, Coinbase. I not I do it not on Coinbase. I don't want to go there. Okay, I'm. I, it's not. Coindesk. There we go. Ah, Mark Cuban invests in Ethereum Layer Two Polygon. Um, I don't know. I I think I, I think we should definitely be. We should be looking at Polygon, but not as much as Dogecoin specifically right now. Maybe in the future it'll do some more cool stuff. Here's an article from it. What is Polygon and Matic, Indian cryptocurrency, how to invest? I believe I believe it's in the top. It's it's toward the top right now. I think it's pretty pretty ring pretty dang high. Crypto.com. What is it currently ranked? Where is it? I think I think it's pretty high. Yeah, there it is. There it is. It's it's a number fifteen at one eighty two right now. Eleven billion dollar market cap. Let's go ahead and click on it and check it out. Oh, nice on three hundred and ninety three thousand watch lists. And based based on the chart, it's it's been really dang steady for the last week. Not much movement at all. It hasn't even really been moving with the ebbs and flows of the entire market, which is a little bit surprising. So basically, that leads me to believe that a lot of investors are kind of outside the market of the typical cryptos which could mean it has more potential than the other ones if a lot more energy starts coming around it. I mean, that's not a lot of movement at all. It looks like it dipped down below $1. And uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see what it does. I mean, I'll, I'll continue looking more into it. But at the end of the day, the ones, the ones that are the safest are going to be the ones in the top seven to have the most potential while also besides Bitcoin, because it's already reached a lot of its potential, at least for this run. But with the other cryptos down the list, we're going to see the most potential there by far, with, with also being a little bit safer if you are looking in the top one through seven there. Um, tether being excluded, so technically one, one, two through six. Matic, Matic has Doge. Oh, that's true. Yeah, there, there, has, there was a bridge between the two. What's your press prediction for Doge at the end of the month? 
<laughs> Mr. J Boxing says that roast was pretty funny. Thank you. Uh, my price prediction for Doge by the end of the month is that we will see it going up above 50 cents and hopefully to that dollar range, but that just depends on when the Coinbase announcement comes. Right now, I, I did predict we'd see it going to 40 cents and look at that, we already saw it happening. And so now the next one is 50 cents that I think is coming not too long from now. And then $1 after that, which is why I put it in the thumbnail there. As Elon Musk been tweeting out some good stuff, this right here coming in 1980, this is Elon Musk as a little pup enjoying his computers and having fun. I'll keep my passion hidden from the public or I'll be socially ostracized. You don't wanna be a social ostrich. You wanna be a normal ostrich. That, that's, that's, that's the best type of ostrich is a normal ostrich. But I, th I, also, th I also thought this article was funny. SEC is running out of options for rating Elon Musk. Yeah, that's right, SEC. You're out of options. You, you hit the dead end road. What, what are you going to do now? Nothing. What's your... Oh, I already wrote that one. All right, anyway, so that, that's all the news for today. Hopefully, you had some fun and uh, you, you enjoyed it. coming along for the Dogecoin ride. I'm excited about the future of this. Also, welcome to Crypto the Week level from Eric the Gold Guy. If you want to join the members, there's a link right down there. You're welcome to do so. There's a lot of benefits for it, so you're welcome to check those out. But anyway, I'm at Wallace. This is Final Stand, and I will see you in the next video. Whew.